In this tutorial, I'm going to show you a really nice quick way of doing face weighted vertex normals, even quicker than the last tutorial that I uh, did for this topic. So, the first thing we need to do is get in there and select all of our edges that we want to bevel. So, there are scripts that will help you with this. Quick Google should show you some. Um, none of them are like perfect one click solutions but they certainly get you a good part of the way there and then you just have to edit the um, selection a little bit whereas obviously this is quite a slow quite a slow process but at least I'm in like you know I find this like at least I know exactly what I've selected and what I haven't whereas when you use one of those scripts you will have to go around the model and figure that out for yourself okay so we could probably take these off the selection and try bubbling again. Um, or we could add these four in like that, and then these as well. So make sure we haven't got any of that cylinder area selected. We don't want to bevel those because that will affect the shape of that circle. Okay, so that might work okay. We've got quads there, but we do have that kind of shape there. Like, we could actually take these four off, bevel that again. Well, that could work a bit better. So it's all about, like, just finding the one that's going to work for you. I'm just going to leave mine like that for now. So um, then what we're going to do is clone the model, so just do Control D. Then I'm going to right mouse click and go to Object Mode and just move him out to there. Now if I go back to Edge Mode, you should see I've got the selection on that one. And I've got the selection on that one. Right, so once that's done, all we need to do on our first one is bevel all these edges. We make sure I set our mitering to none. It has to be on none. And our fraction can be whatever we like and whatever looks good, as long as when we do our next version, it also has an identical fraction. So make sure you remember that. So none and then whatever you want in there. So we'll go to edge mode on this one now. Shift, right click, bevel edge, put our fraction down to 0.3. We can leave our mitering this time on um, auto, but we must set our segments to 4. And the reason we do this is because what it's actually doing is um, before we were selecting all our faces and setting our vertex normal to face, because we now have 4 bevels, this automatically has the um, face normal correct. So all we need to do is copy the face normals of this one onto this one. So if I select our clone and then select our, the one we actually want, we'll go to Mesh, we'll go to Transfer Attributes. And I'm just going to reset the settings on this um, and then go through them so you know what to do. So Vertex Position, we don't want to affect that, but we do want to take the Vertex Normal. We don't want our UV sets or our color sets. We want to be working in local space and everything else I think is fine. So if we just hit Apply, we saw our model change then. If we just now browse around our model, we should see we have kind of perfect uh, face weighted vertex normals on that asset. So yeah, that's a really nice, really quick way of doing um, Oh, I think you actually need to delete history on that and then you can take it out. There we go. So yeah, that's much quicker than the, pre the way I showed you in my previous video, and you have loads of control over it too, so it's like, it's a really good solution.